One of the first questions asked by users who are new to scripting in Maya, or even professionals who have been using MEL for years, is why should you use Python instead of MEL? Now, there are many reasons for using Python, many benefits. Python is an advanced scripting language. It has been developed over the past 20 years and continues to evolve to this day. MEL, on the other hand, is largely unchanged since it was first introduced with the original versions of Maya. The Python community is massive, and it continues to grow to this day. New developers are learning Python as their first language, and many existing developers are making the switch to Python. MEL, on the other hand, is limited to a small number of Maya users. Many of the scripts are proprietary and maintained by studios and never get released to the community at large. Sites such as Creative Crash do a good job of opening up the MEL community, but it is still very small when compared to the Python community. Now there are a very large number of legacy MEL scripts that exist to this day. They're very useful and there is little need to rewrite these scripts in order to make them work with Python. MEL scripts can be executed directly from the Python interpreter inside of Maya. Additional benefits to using Python include the extensive standard libraries and the third-party support. Many of the tasks that you will need to accomplish inside of Maya will already have code developed and tested and debugged that you can leverage in your tools. Now, unlike MEL, Python isn't unique to Maya. Python is quickly becoming a standard in the animation and VFX industries. Python can be found in applications such as Maya, Nuke, Blender, Houdini, and many others. Python can also be used as the glue to connect different pipeline elements. If you use different applications, one for modeling, one for animation, one for VFX, Python can be used to connect these elements together and allow the flow of data from the start of the pipeline all the way through to the end. Now, this is not to say that you shouldn't at least have an understanding of MEL. MEL is still very important when you are working with Maya. Maya is built using MEL. The interface is composed of a bunch of MEL scripts. If you dig into the Maya install directory, you'll be able to find all the startup scripts and the UI scripts that compose the Maya interface. This will help you understand how Maya works. And if you are looking to recreate some of the features that exist in Maya in your own tools, odds are you're gonna be looking through the existing MEL scripts. By having an understanding of MEL, it will become easier to integrate parts of those MEL scripts into your Python scripts. There really are thousands of legacy MEL scripts out there, both internally in Maya's program files and on sites such as Creative Crash. It's not necessary to rewrite these scripts inside of Python, but being able to deconstruct them and understand the inner workings of them can be very beneficial to your own tools development. And one of the last reasons for understanding MEL is that many of the commands that are displayed in the output window are in MEL. So when you execute a command and you wanna look at the trace to see what command is being run and what flags are being set, this will always be displayed in MEL. And again, understanding how MEL works will make it easier to convert these commands into Python.